the system worked for me. I liked it. I dug it. I fucking love wrestling. I love that shit. I loved when they would. Johnny came in one time and said, "Hey, anyone know who uh, what used to walk around with a boombox on their shoulder? Rock and roll box room hall." And everyone looks like, "Shut up, you fucking ass!" But I loved it. <laughs> and the trainers, each individual trainer, brought you something. Bill gave me hair on my balls. Mm -hmm. He used to fucking fight you. He I, laid on top of you. He was a 300 pound man. You had no to get away from him. fuck with me because I dealt with Bill. Like, he made you have such tough skin. And the like, way I looked at it. You couldn't get under my skin if you tried, man. That's nine just, in wrestling, at least. You know, nine out of ten no people way. on the street aren't mm -hmm. showing. Okay? Thank God. But after going with fucking Bill for three minutes, I can go with any guy that tries to take my grandma's purse. Yeah. And, and that's great. And then there, you had Jody Hamilton. The original assassin. I love that shit. I just never figured out which way he wanted me to turn on a drop kick. That was so annoying. What was it? He wants you to go left? He wants you Because I go right. I go... Sorry. You go left. What do you do? I go drop kick. Nice. Yeah. In any event. Think about it. How many times have you seen me drop kick? I don't know. I don't think about it. throw a drop kick in a real that's fight. That's crazy. Don't happen. Yeah, that was his big, uh, <laughs> big stickler for that, where he landed. And then, and Dave Taylor, who was, again, remember, you have to remember, for, for me, all of my favorites all had like extensions of themselves. So like, my favorite's William Regal. Here comes Dave Taylor. Oh. So I hung on his every word. And then they brought in like guest guys that some of them, might, like like Greg Gagne, he, he actually, for a long, for a while, so you make that, and, I, I'm, and we all kind of were like. But then one day Greg Gagne did this head scissors that no one does, this old school Ricky Star Holy dude, what, head scissors. I, okay, so he's like, Just show me a head scissor or whatever. And I did the, it, it was me. I jumped up and just did the regular one, you know, and the guy that's rolls what through. He thinks. Like, what the it's not fuck? a head scissor. He's like, a head scissor. And he kept saying, a head scissor. And we're all like, dude, I don't know what you're talking about. Like, yeah, I have no you're, clue. You're thinking old school rock and roll dude, express head the scissors. The running, and then like the guy so posed, and then yeah. you pose at the top, and, and then roll through. Beautiful. Because that's what he wanted. I'm the like, best part about Greg Gagne is if you look at him, he looks exactly like Greg Brady he as does. a grown man. Yeah, it's weird. So it's whatever his Barry, whatever that guy's name is, <laughs> doing a fucking head scissor. And I go, you know something? You can learn something from everyone. 